Hello, and welcome to Crappy Design. Check out our sponsor, the like button, which is super well designed right down below the video or somewhere if you're watching on a TV. Let's start off with number 19. How do you spell Christmas? Give me an A. Give me an S. Give me another S. What does that spell? But, not Christmas. Why would you do it backwards and reverse up the, who would, why would you do your store display like that? No one's gonna realize until they just read as, um, as, TM, trademarked, but, trademarked, why? We're gonna get a lot of Christmas posts in this one, aren't we? This evil looking Christmas duck that I only realized the other day is supposed to be rosy cheeks, not horrifying red eyes. Oh yeah, that, that doesn't that doesn't look like rosy cheeks. <laughs> Those look like eyebrows. That looks like it's about to laser beam me, dude. I'm about to just get like sliced in half with Superman eyes from this Santa duck. Have I been that naughty for Christmas? You can just give me coal. We can stick to the old fashioned way. You don't have to laser beam me, okay? These latex masks I found while looking for Zootopia images. I'm convinced that the Groot one will possess anyone that wears it. What? <laughs> Why is it so long though? It looks like it's it's like for a head that's this big. It, it's, it's the longest head of all time. Who has a head that's like that long and pointy? But then the Groot one is like not that. The proportions on the Groot one are just totally different. They're just Groot is nice and squat. The others super long. They have a whole bunch of sizes to fit every style of head out there. I'm pretty sure that's not how you're supposed to hold a sight. Anytime is holiday time in LA. <laughs> Wait, what? Is this a tourism sign? Full information from SA Government Tourist Bureau. Heck yeah, dude. This definitely makes me want to go to Adelaide in Australia, I assume. Just let me, it'll, will I be able to go there and I can just hold a scythe by the blade? That sounds like a great idea. Why wouldn't I want to do that? And then I can use the stick to make sure to, to cut the grass real nicely. We wouldn't want to be too mean to the grass. That poor grass doesn't deserve to be cut, okay? Instead, I'll cut my hand and we'll use the stick to kind of just wave the grass around. Beautiful car spa pan billboard at the Italian restaurant I visited yesterday. Car spa pan. BGN. Anna het eto routine. What? Oh, 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 car bonara, spaghetti. Why did you capitalize the fourth letter completely randomly or just make it super large? I don't, I don't understand. Are they all, they're actually, all the words are the same length. That's, that's fun fact I didn't actually realize. But why, why this way? Why did you... Don't dead open inside all of your pastas. It doesn't, it, even the sign on its own just doesn't really make a lot of sense. I'm like, oh, it's about a car? What's a, what's an owner ra? I've never heard of that model of a car before. Wow, I should look that up. No, no Google search results. It must be a really rare car, dude, that I haven't seen. I'm gonna spend my life searching for it. These pictograms from a German governmental crown FAQ are quite scary. I think we've seen this one before, so, um, but just in case. The masks do be looking like scary open mouths, but hey, it's it's giving you like both sides. On one hand, if you're not wearing a mask, you are ejecting lots of evil looking uh, virus over other people potentially, but if you're wearing a mask, then it's not. So that's cool. Yeah, you can barely see the Lego bricks on this instructional packet. I feel like if you're gonna have dark Legos, maybe you should do a, a lighter background or maybe there's a whole wide range of colors on the Legos for this particular packet, but instead of adding like, I don't know, an outline to them, you should do a light background because then the dark pieces will show up and then the light pieces, you can just do a black outline on them and it'll all be visible. This is very surprising because Lego is usually very, very well designed. You don't think of Lego and crappy design going with each other. They usually, like, they, they're good. So that, that surprises me a whole lot right there. Come on, Lego, don't be slipping up, okay? Make the instruction manual light colored next time. Disney font puts the fun in funeral. Busca, funeral home, Inc. Commitment to, I thought it said curing, and I was like, 
well, you can't really cure that. <laughs> uh, so do you mean curing the body? So that it, is that what you have to do after it's embalmed? You gotta cure the embalmment? So we've got a commitment to that kind of curing. Oh no. It really does look like it though because of the, the little dark background right there. Commitment to curing. <laughs> Oh, I don't like I don't like that idea. But yeah, you definitely think of a lot of unalive when you think of the Disney font. What font should we use for our funeral home? Yeah, the one that appears in front of kids' movies, for sure. This is made for toddlers, and I can't find a single word. Bag full of toys, words are baseball, book, doll, game, puppet, puzzle, skates, train. Are you really going to make me go and look through this and see if I can find... I see bod... Yeah, dude, that's that's pretty. That's that's nice. I see um your I see what else have we got? Uh it's a tough one, dude. Line. I see line right there. We got a word. We got our first word, ladies and gentlemen. Uh Nessie, the Loch Ness monster. Uh sum, like the sum of of various numbers. And yeah, I'm just gonna go out on a limb and say that these ones are not in there. <laughs> these mannequins want to eat your soul. I don't like that. Who's gonna shop there? Why do they look like this? Why are their mouths so wide? I don't. Are they fans of Kiss? Are you gonna do the Gene Simmons thing? Why are they both like this? Why is? Why did you do the same mannequin with just different wigs on, but both with the terrifying mouth? I'm pretty sure that there's horror movie characters that look like this. I don't like it. It doesn't make me want to shop. Don't do that. Change your mannequins. This driveway that doesn't line up. Hmm. Yeah, you would you would think that you would want the driveway to I don't know fully encompass the garage entry exit. That might that might be good. Not that it's you know you can't enter the the garage, but how did they mess this one up? I mean, they probably built the house first, right, and then. Maybe there wasn't a garage though. Maybe they added a garage retroactively and it was like, hey, you know, the driveway's already here and we don't want to re-pour it because that would be a pain. So we'll just deal with it, you know, being a little bit mi misaligned. There's got to be a logical explanation for this and not that they just made the house and then they poured the driveway incorrectly because that wouldn't make any sense, right? Pants that make you look really pissed. Whoever came up with this design had to know what it was going to look like, right? Right? They were just gonna like, see if anyone would actually end up buying them. See if they could get away with trolling people without realizing. They'd walk out of the store, put them on, and be like, oh shoot, I really didn't realize until someone pointed out. They, it does look like I really peed myself real badly. Like the most significant pee my pants episode that anyone has ever experienced in their entire lives. It's all the way down to my feet. I just can't, it just isn't stopping. I drank like two gallons of water, and I'm sorry, I just gotta let it go. Nothing I can do. Flashy new display screens on the drink coolers at my local chain grocery store. Now you have to open the door to see what's actually inside. Wait, so it just... <laughs> it doesn't actually have any of the things that are on the door, which is why we put the door there. We were running low on stock, so we just... We, ju we just make it look like it's nice and colorful when there's actually nothing in there. Maybe there's a way to go between opaque and transparent, depending upon if they're completely out of stock. We'll just put the screen there so it looks better and not all empty. And if it's fully in stock, we can just make it go transparent. It's like the electrochromatic electrochromat electro glass. I think I'm saying that right, except it's a display screen. Two windows of my workplace are constantly fighting for the honor of being the one who's gonna be opened. I have a, I have a couple drawers like that in my kitchen. It's like, you can only do one at a time. You can't do both. One's gonna run into the other, so... I mean, you know, sometimes, uh, sometimes it do be this way. I mean, alternatively, you could just do it so that they open, like, horizontally. Like, like that. Like this, this way, and that way, and then, yeah, you could... You could open them, you'd open them both. There was a way to accomplish this. This just wasn't it. Maybe they just didn't want it to open all the way because they don't want things going in or out. I don't know, there are ways to solve that problem, too, but... They're just like, nah. Cleaning the exterior of this area is a huge pain. It, I mean, it is literally crappy design, I I suppose. You know, I really, I really haven't, I really haven't gone and done that. 
to be honest with you. I haven't really... I probably should. Probably a lot of dust in there. But, yeah, it's it's never like a fun thing to get on your hands and knees and go around the back of the toilet and be like, okay, it's time to clean here. Um, so, I don't even want to look. I don't even want to look. No, we're just going to be blissfully ignorant about it. My friend's under the stairs bathroom where the toilet is diagonal and part partially installed into the carpeted... Oh, why is it always carpeted? It's always a carpeted bathroom on this sub every month. Oh. Oh, I want to leave. I don't want to be here anymore. Oh, no. Who did this? Oh, it just looks like a room with a non-functional toilet sitting in it. And it was at that point that I thought... Am I going to be demonetized in this house? Do I not know my friends as well as I thought I did? Am I not going to walk out of here alive? This is when you walk in on me and you're like, all right, well, we've been friends for a while and I was just luring you up to the point where I pull a Dexter on you. The legs are the exact same length, even though one is bent. Huh. This is oddly specific. <laughs> I'm more impressed that you were you you looked at this image and you're like there's something wrong with the leg. Allow me to photoshop and investigate. <laughs> Cuz it doesn't even like it doesn't even look that off when you're just looking at the movie poster. And then you're, I guess I guess you're right. I guess you're right. These legs are not the same length. One is very very long. That would be a very inconvenient thing and you would have to either get an operation you'd have to wear a shoe that has a very thick sole on one side you're not wrong but it it's very impressive for the sake of ensuring that the framing works well in this poster she already won and three pieces are floating epic lineup four not connect for lineup four it's it's the word line from that word search that we looked at before they found one of the words all right oh dude she's about to dude she just needs to double win Okay, she just needs to put this kid to shame over here. Look at that face. He can't handle the fact he's about to get double dunked. Even though he could have just put a yellow over there. Why didn't you put a yellow over there, you fool? You had the chance to win before she could win. Why didn't... I don't understand. You had, you had a perfect... You had a perfect setup right here. You would... You, you could have... Okay, so hold... You had to... What? But you just... She, uh, you already won, yellow kid! How the frick did she win and then win again, you idiot? You had it in the bag. That's such a terrible setup. I'm so mad. This is just infuriating. And the top, for the last month, the paper in this sliced cheese makes it look as if it has mold spots. Oh no, it really does look like that, though. <laughs> oh, why? That's unfortunate. You shouldn't have put your logo on that. I wonder if they'll ever realize, or if they're just always going to be like, Why don't we have good sales? I can't figure it out. I mean, our cheese is great. We taste it. We've tasted it, like, right after a blind taste test with another. It's really good. No one seems to be buying it. We can't figure out why. I hope they see this post. And they adjust their strategy so that they can succeed at business. That's it. Thanks for watching Crappy Design. Make sure to like if you like. It's a great sponsor. Also, sub to the channel. Hit the bell. And check the playlist if you want to catch more crappy design. Also, you can catch just the last crappy design by clicking the end screen right up here. And there's another end screen below it for the Marin Music upload that was uploaded most recently. Pretty cool. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later.